Warning, the following video is an example of how you should not destroy a magic amulet. If you would like to destroy an amulet, please consult a professional before taking matters into your own hands. Viewer discretion is advised. Uh, I don't know what I'm unleashing. Uh, I see something. So already guys, you can see as we open this up, there's something written over here. I can see there's some numbers happening over here. No! How could this protect you when this can't even protect itself? No! Way of Life SQ, keeping it a hundred. Assalamu alaikum, welcome back to my YouTube channel. As you can see, I finally made it out. I, if you know me, then you know that I don't like being cooped up in my house uh, recording videos. I like to do it outdoors. I like people to see what I'm doing. Um, and it, just, it just makes the dawah stronger. It gives me more confidence about what I'm doing and it just allows me to do what I got to do. So anyways, uh, the title is absolutely true. Today we are going to be destroying a Tawiz or a magic amulet as you some might know. I'm going to be switching over here but uh, we're going to be dealing with this. I'll give you a better shot soon. Uh, I just want to tell you a few things that's happened already uh, because of this. Uh, amulet. So I was looking for something to destroy uh, because I was thinking, you know, it'd be really cool if I could just open and destroy an amulet, show you what's inside of it. And you guys need to know about these things. This is just pure disgusting devil worship stuff. People in the most pious forms come to you to talk to you, to, to do these things. But in reality, it's just absolutely disgusting. So uh, uh, without further ado, let's, let's break into this amulet and let's actually see what this is all about. What's actually in this piece of garbage uh, that you pay money for or trust in besides Allah for. So anyways, let's get into this video right now. And let's switch it up. All right, we're going to try to open this over here. I hope this is in focus. I'll try my best. Uh, but it's gonna be a little troublesome, okay? But I'm gonna do my absolute best. Make dua that this is successful. Uh, I don't know what I'm unleashing. Uh, some of you might be like, SQ, you should maybe leave this to the professionals. You're probably right, but then I wouldn't be who I am, wouldn't I? No! I don't wanna get infected by it. You know how they show you in like the movies, you get bit by something? Ah, 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 ah. it's opening up, it's opening up, it's opening up. Okay. This garbage open. Ah, I see something. So already, guys, you can see as we open this up, there's something written over here. It's in this uh, protective, uh, advanced NASA technology uh, wrap. Uh, I'm just joking. It's just a shopper, as they call them. It's a shopper. Uh, I'm gonna toss this on the floor because I need my hands fully okay. We're just gonna rip this garbage up. Like, look how nice they make it look. Make a little dill on it, you know. But it's just pure. It's pure evil. Pure garbage. How can you trust in anything but Allah besides Allah? A'udhu Billah. This is gone. Okay, I will pick it up. Don't worry, guys. I don't litter. I don't believe in littering. Okay. So we're opening this up. A'udhu Billah min shaitan al-rajim. As you can see, it was in this protective casing. I'm just going to put this here. We're not going to be littering. Don't worry. So let's open this up. Let's see what this is all about. Let's hopefully we can track this a little better. Uh, I'm sorry if this is not as focused as you'd like it to be. So let's see what these things are. Let's see what's in this. Okay. So. Uh, as you can see, it's folded multiple times to fit in this. And it's saying something in Urdu. It's definitely Urdu. It's not Arabi. Right? You would think that if you're trying to do some hifazat, it'd be like in pure Arabi, but no. I mean, why would it be? Right? Ah. Okay, I can't really read Urdu. Uh, but I see there's a parchi. And there's some stuff over here. I can see there's some numbers happening over here. How could this be any hifazat? Like, how, how could this be any good? Just, just look at this garbage, bro. Like, look at it. How could this protect you when this can't even protect itself? Wasn't this the argument of the idols that they used to worship around the Kaaba? They used to make this exact same, oh look, I just ripped it. Oh no, I ripped it, right? It's very fragile, as you could tell. Um, there's some numbers over here happening. Then it says something on the bottom. I don't know if you guys can read this. I hope you guys are able to. As you can see guys, this is it. This is the garbage. This is the garbage that people want to do. And we're just gonna stomp this out on the floor a little bit because it's just disgusting. It's just disgusting. I was really in the shaitan regime. Listen, guys. The messenger saw some had black magic done against him. Um, and when that took place, that is when Surah Nas and Falak were revealed. And the protections of from against black magic and Sihr and uh, Ayn and all that sort of stuff uh, was given to us then. And it is reciting Nas and Falak three times each in the morning and evening. 
and reading the Ayatul Kursi three times in the morning, three times in the evening. So that's what it all really just comes down to. Reciting those things, read your adhkar, read your dhikr, guys, and nothing will be able to touch you. Because if something has affected you or your family, it's happened by the permission of Allah. Okay, so don't over-empower the black magic or anything like that, or the jinns or whatever. Don't empower the soothsayers. Don't empower them. Understand that this is happening from the permission of Allah so that maybe you could get closer to Him. Do ruqya on yourself. It's not just you have to call someone from the outside. Read your salah. That serves as a purification. It will help you read the Quran, read things upon yourself. And believe me, things will get better for you guys. Uh, please, please, please make dua for all those who are dealing and suffering with black magic and get rid of these garbage things, guys. There's nothing in these. This is this is in everyone's thing. Give or take something like that. Love you all for the sake of Allah. And until next time, I'm out.